ChatGPT has just released ChatGPT Tasks, and this one is quite powerful and quite new. ChatGPT can send you reminders, can send you things directly to your mailbox or directly to the app of ChatGPT. And in this video, I'll show you six use cases that I started to use myself that are really cool. Some of them are linked to work, some of them are just linked to things that I like. And let me show you all this on my screen. So if you go to ChatGPT, here you'll find the new model GPT 4.0 with scheduled tasks. It's on beta version. It was just released last week. So if you click on it, it'll take you in here. It looks the same as the other chat GPT interface. And the first use case that I want to share with you is to stay informed in your industry. So for example, we can type, send me a daily newsletter about AI where I get the most trending topics of the day. Send it to me on chat. GPT at 7.30 a.m. UK time. So here you can either ask ChatGPT to send it to you via your email and you can put in your email in here, which I'm not doing because I don't want to share my personal email. Or you can ask it to send it to you directly on ChatGPT and you can find it in here every morning. So this is completely up to you. And you just click press. And what ChatGPT will do is to create this reminder or task for you. And every morning it will send you an AI newsletter or whatever your focus is. It could be software development, it could be marketing, it could be anything. And you can even specify what location, what industries, you can go very specific depending on your needs. So this is the very cool first thing that I would, I would say anyone can use themselves. Instead of going and digging into articles yourself, you can just receive a newsletter like this every morning. So if you click on it, you can see the task. If you want to go and adjust the instructions, you can do it here. If you want to adjust the schedule, you can do it here. Pause or delete as well, all in one place. A second cool one will be to use ChatGPT as an accountability partner. So usually when you work out or you have some sort of goals, you like to have someone with you that reminds you, pushes you to do more, and you can use ChatGPT to do so. So if we do, for example, be my accountability partner, I want you to send me daily messages at 4.30 p.m. after work to motivate me to go to the gym. Share a powerful quote and remind me why I started in the first place to improve my physique. Send a notification on chat GPT directly. And here you are. This one, ChatGPT will serve as an accountability partner and will send you every day at 4.30 p.m. It will send you a motivational quote, something that will remind you why you started in the first place. And it's quite powerful. You'll have this reminder that you know at that moment of the day, you'll be quite low in terms of energy. And that reminder could be the push that you needed uh, in order to take action. So whatever suits you, whatever timing, whatever your goals, you can incorporate this one in your routine. The third one, and this one is really interesting for people that are learning a new language, you can ask ChatGPT to daily give you new things to learn. So for example, you can say, I'm learning French. Can you give me two sentences, one daily grammar tip and one random tip? So here you can ask it to help you daily to get new things about French. Send it daily at 8 a.m. on ChatGPT. So this one, ChatGPT will serve as a French instructor for you. So I used to say to my girlfriend, in order to learn a language, it's good to learn a few sentences completely so that you can reuse them daily. So if you get those two sentences without going and checking on Google or somewhere, you get them directly from ChatGPT. All you need to do in the morning is spend 10 minutes on these and that's all. You can move on with your work, with your life. And on the next day, you'll get two new ones and you can even ask ChatGPT to create some sort of table or spreadsheet for you so you can get back to them and keep on building upon the previous ones that you had. And if you want to go and have a look at all your tasks, you just click on these three buttons in here. You can see view all the tasks and you can see all the ones that are scheduled and you can see all the ones that were sent already. And since all of these were not sent yet, they're all in the scheduled status in here. If you're enjoying this so far, remember to give this a like and subscribe to the channel. I will share more tips about how to use ChatGPT for data scientists, but also for any other industry. And these tips could benefit you. So if you're enjoying it, remember to give it a like. Number four is generate content ideas for content creators. So for example, give me three topics daily that I could speak about on YouTube or LinkedIn. Provide a brief description on each topic and relevant resources. Send 
me the reminder daily at 12 p.m. on ChatGPT. So here, ChatGPT will send you three topics that you can cover in your social media, on YouTube, whatever you create content, and you'll have always this flow of ideas coming your way. Number five, and this is a lighter one, you can ask ChatGPT to give you some cool things about a specific topic. So for example, you can say, give me two cool things about marketing on a daily basis. Something fun that I can share with friends during our conversations. Send it to me at 6 p.m. UK time daily. In this one, ChatGPT will send you some cool marketing tips that you can share with your friends and you can start bragging about how much you know in marketing. And the last one, this one is for sports enthusiasts. You can ask ChatGPT to give you the news that you want for your team. So for example, you can say, I'm a big Real Madrid fan. Share with me all the news about Real Madrid on a daily basis at 8 a.m. UK time. Also mention all the player transfers if there are any with the price. And in this one, ChatGPT will send you all the news about your favorite team directly into your app or into your email. And like this, you have things related to your passion, to your hobbies, to your work, to your IQ, all these things directly sent to you by ChatGPT. Obviously, you can refine the output. You can ask for the output to be as simple as a text, for the output to have pictures or to be as a table. You can ask it to track the financial industry you can ask it to track some sort of index fund anything that you want directly will come to you to your newsletter and it's as powerful as you yourself creating a full newsletter just by prompting ChatGPT and use it to share it with people that follow you on your email newsletter so as you can see this is powerful I just share with you six things that I use myself and I hope that you can tweak it and adjust it for yourself as well well, let me know in the comments, what do you use ChatGPT tasks for? Because this is just starting and no one really knows what's the extent of how much we can use this tool and it can only keep on improving. I've also made a video about the AI Google Studio where you can directly interact with the AI, showing your screen and asking direct questions and getting direct responses via voice, which is amazing to learn anything. So if you're stuck using a tool, a software, for example, Excel or Notion or PowerPoint, you can directly show your screen and speak to the AI and it can help you directly fix your problems. I made the video, I'll link it just here or you'll find it in the description below. Thank you for watching.